Recognize these faces? These are the brilliant stars that light up your favorite daytime dramas. Coming up, E! takes you inside New York's Planet Hollywood for a behind-the-scenes, in-the-front-row, and up-on-the-podium look at the third annual Soap Opera Hall of Fame Awards. Stay tuned for a parade of familiar faces and a few surprises. so excited all over again. Well, and I'm Mimi Torchin, editor-in-chief of Soap Opera Weekly. Welcome to New York, welcome to Planet Hollywood, and welcome to an award show that isn't just any award show. This is not just any golden statue fest. This is the real thing. This is the big one, the Hall of Fame Awards. As editor-in-chief of Soap Opera Weekly, my uh, staff and I created the Hall of Fame. It's honoring all of the great people who have made a lasting contribution to the daytime. It's a lifetime achievement award. And look at all the stars that are here. My God, they all turned out to honor That's each true. other That's and true. themselves. That's a great showing from daytime television. Surprised to see all you wonderful people here, huh? Right? It's the smallest board of soaps, man. You know, I love it. Very exciting night. I'm thrilled about it. It's uh, it's really quite wonderful. I've said I would happily host the American Hemorrhoid Association for a free trip to New York. <laughs> Inside, daytime's brightest stars gather to honor this year's inductees. This current batch joins 11 past inductees who have achieved soap opera immortality. It is pretty heady, and our nominees, though, however, can, can hold their heads up in any crowd. Tonight, we're honoring four new inductees into the Soap Opera Hall of Fame. First up, Ruth Warwick. She's played the meddling patriarch Phoebe Tyler Wallingford on All My Children since the show premiered in 1970. But did you know Ruth is also a veteran of... of we got an Emmy nominee for that part. Want to know which primetime soap? 
Stay tuned. Our second nominee is producer Gloria Monti. Back in the late 70s, she took over a little daytime show that was two months away from cancellation and drove it to the top of the ratings by introducing a couple oh, you might have heard of. Luke and Laura? Yeah, I heard of them. Plus, we'll honor Betty Ray, the casting director. Movie stars like Marissa Tomei, Meg Ryan, and Kevin Bacon owe their careers to. And then, of course, there's the delectable diva of daytime. As the world turns, Eileen Fulton. But I think I'll let her co-star Don Hastings give you the real dish. Eileen Fulton. Eileen Fulton came on As the World in 1960, married Bob Hughes, and then left him for a shoe salesman, and P&G doesn't even make shoes. Anyway, she's being installed tonight in the Hall of Fame. Soap opera Hall of Fame. Mimi, that's a great choice. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Also, she's one of daytime's brightest, who occasionally moonlights as a guest star on her favorite soap. Who is she? Her identity later. Yeah, this is Valley Flores. 